Warning, the following game which you are about to view is rated M for Mature due to blood and gore and violence. Also, this is a horror game, so scary sights and scenes await. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello everyone, this is Tailspin109, and welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil Code Veronica X Blind. In the last video, we finished up Claire's bit of the story, it seems, and now we're playing as Chris, but... Fun little story, um... I decided to... Replay through the game again, so I can have the weapons Claire had. I had no idea I was actually going to lose them that way. But then I realized I had left some stuff in the security box and couldn't get it back. Fearing an unwinnable game, I played through the game AGAIN! Just to get back here! Oh my gosh, I'm not gonna forget this. Anyways, this time I have a bunch of items, and yeah, I've saved a lot less as well. I've saved only 12 times this time. So I'm just gonna start back here, because now I'm gonna try and take care of that worm to save the guy, as Chris says I should do. I have an assault rifle this time, so... And I turned up the brightness a bit, so this will probably be a little easier. Okay. There's herbs there. Ow. Okay, how much did that hurt? Alright, one hit's not enough to thrust me into caution. Good. Okay. So I guess now this is kind of like a boss fight. Oh, shoot. It only takes two, though. Oh my gosh. Alright, well, not in a limping state yet. He has a lot of health. Uh oh, ow. Oh, what? No, okay, I'm on yellow. I'm imagining things. What am I on now, though? One more hit's probably gonna be all it takes. Oh, I killed him. Hey! Well, so far it sounds like Chris isn't going to do all the stupid lines that he did in the first game. I don't want to hear any root of the problem or sleeping with the ultimate failure or is that you, Rebecca? Alright. Now then, I have a lighter, so... Ow. There we go. I can't pick it up yet. I'm gonna have to put some stuff down. I probably won't need the bow gun for now. I don't know. I also made sure Chris had some extra handgun ammo during Claire's little bout. So that he would have a little more to work with. Now I'll be able to take him. There we go. Now I got good weapons. Alright. There we go. Let me just save some progress. Just so I don't have to fight the worm again, I have so many ink ribbons, I might as well go to town on it. 
Okay, now it's time to rewatch some stuff I've already done. I apologize, but hey, I have played through this game so many times. You think you could guys just give me a little break with having to watch a little extra stuff again? Now, Chris has a knife, so I should probably have a knife with me. Alright, but I'm in much better hands now, and I have the fire extinguisher this time, so that's good. Let's pick up these herbs. I'm gonna have to heal up. As long as... That was a blue one. Alright, fine. That wasn't how I planned it, but whatever. It's full health. But again, not how I planned it. Okay. Sorry about this. But this is important to take care of right now. Well, I am going to be running to the spiders, so maybe care that's not my... It's not that far to the next save. It really isn't. Now, while replaying, I re-remembered some handgun parts in the basement of the train facility, so I should probably try to get that. What's that? That looks like something. Oh! Too bad I already put my bow gun away. Huh? There's more? Or am I just... No? Okay. Okay. Cool. Yes, but now it shouldn't be an eternity because, yeah. Yeah, because I killed the guy, they're not going to make me wait. It was a nice panic mechanism if you kept the worm alive, though. I'll admit that. Wait, there should be blue herbs right next to where those spiders pop out, so I shouldn't have to worry all that much. Oh well, whatever. What else am I gonna need to pick up on my way to the save room? Alright. Oh my gosh, I didn't even realize I had it equipped. Alright. Let's get the knife out! The knife is actually good in this one. Get so many hits in! It might be weak, but the fact that it gets in... He's not dead, is he? No, he's dead. Um, oh, right, gotta get the battery. And you're a little close, so I will just... Oh, nice. Just gotta hit the right spot and they drop and you do so much damage. Oh my gosh. Can't believe how good this actually is. I can't go in here, right? Yeah, it's blocked by rubble. Right, okay. I'll eventually have to find a way into the basement so that I can upgrade Chris's gun by the looks of it. Alright. I turned the brightness up a fair amount, but it still does look a little dark. I don't want it to be too bright. But I just want to make sure um, things can actually be seen and... I think that still might be an issue. I apologize for this. Maybe I gotta adjust more than just the brightness. I have no idea. Alright, Chris, let's go in and get scared by spiders. Wait, first of all... There. Might actually want to use the bow gun a bit until I get the handgun upgrade, because the bow gun is, at the very least, faster. Uh, is this just another blue herb? Uh, no, I think that one's actually green. It looks blue. Alright, let's just go in here quick. Take out the bow gun briefly. I can't even take out the ink ribbons right now. There we go. And these are the shotgun shells, right? I believe so. Oh, uh, I kind of forgot the puzzle brief right now. I'll look later. I should be able to get through this relatively fast, at least. 
Okay. Yeah, it might be a good idea to just use the bow gun for the time being. I still want to have a nice weapon on me, though, so I'll probably keep the submachine gun for now, but I can afford to empty out a little bit of space. I might want to keep the handgun. Just ammo, just in case I run into some. Oh, wait, are these acid rounds? Yeah, now that I actually have the grenade launcher on me, I can actually make use of it. Oh my gosh, I want to just pick up the ink ribbons. There. Oh, <laughs> I'm full again. Hmm. Alright. There we go. I actually have a decent amount of those. Nice. We still gotta save them, though. 24! <laughs> and you know, if I'm using the bow gun, I'm probably not gonna be using the knife. So, put that away. That's best in combination with the handgun. Honestly. Okay, let me take a look at the puzzle solution again. Yeah, okay. Red, green, blue, brown. I like it when I actually get some unique puzzles. Red, green, blue, and brown. Oh, uh, yes, I'm gonna need that somewhere. And then there's this herb. <laughs> Until I get a shotgun, I have no reason to really lug around all this stuff, do I? You know, that released... There's a side pack nearby. I remember. There was a side pack nearby, wasn't there? I'm pretty sure I recall picking one up. I'm sure of it. Where where was the side pack? I'm sure I ran into it relatively early on. Hope I don't miss it this time around. Alright, get ready because honestly these spiders can be a bit of a hassle. I just love how Chris hardly even flinched. Actually, he didn't flinch at all. Wow! It's quite a beating even with these things. Alright, what's the other one? Alright, how much did I use up on that? Already? That goes fast! Woof! Huh? Hang on. What's this? There's more! Let me pick this up first. Oh. Blue worm! Dang it! <laughs> and it wasn't even the right one that I wanted. There was apparently another one. Oh well, store them away. I could eventually use them, I suppose. Mm. Maybe I should put the submachine gun away. This really is taking up... Until I find the, uh, the side pack... I really shouldn't. I have a lot of blue herbs in here. What the heck? Yeah. I'm afraid I'm going to put that kind of stuff away until I actually have the side pack to hold stuff with. No, it doesn't appear it was in here, but I know it was somewhere. I know I picked one up. I just don't remember where. This is a green one, correct? Good, let's combine those after I pick up these shells! Alrighty. Wait, I have another blue orb in my inventory. I mean, I suppose carrying one around isn't a bad idea, but I don't recall seeing any enemies that poisoned me, at least as far as I went, so... Better idea to put that away, I don't need it right now. Even if I did get poisoned right now, there's an infinite supply in here. And store that away, and okay, I've got space. Yeah, I'm probably just gonna use the bow gun for now. I don't think I need anything else. 
I should at least save, right? Yeah, I've got 24 ink ribbons. Still my first playthrough, technically. I know I replayed the first half numerous times, but I still don't know what to expect in this second half of the game, so I'm saving. Alright, if I can get to the cutscene with Wesker, I'm good, and unfortunately, the Hunters. Yeah, this should do for now. Alright, let's go. Wonder when I'll go into that manhole. Oh! Excuse me. Alright, let's see how far I can get. I want to get back to where I was. Don't exactly remember where I was. I think it was after the Hunter Star game hinted out. So I don't think I have too far to go. Yeah, that's not shotgun shells. Alright, I don't have to worry about space now. I've got four spaces until I find the side pack. That will do me very well. I just hope I don't miss it this time. Maybe I ought to look that one up quickly just to make sure I don't miss it again. Ah, chemical storage key and a file. This was important. Oh yeah, okay, this is important. I'll look at it again when I have to. For now, I can't keep wasting your guys' time. I know you've already seen this, and I apologize for that. <laughs> it's not my fault that the game is not very clear on how it's going to do things. Oh. Right, okay, this is the cut. So I did get a little farther than this. We don't need to watch this again. Alexia. I don't really like the way Wesker sounds, and I'm still not sure why Wesker's even alive in the first place. I'm still not sure how I feel about that, honestly. Uh, just check up here quickly. Hmm. Alright. Let's go in here quickly, because I know there were items to get in here. Around this area, at least. Oh, yes. It falls after I step down, right? Oh, uh, no. It's before. Now, of course, I'm going out to eventually start worrying about the hunters, but I haven't seen him yet, so... Let's just say for the time being, I'm safe. Right now, all I gotta deal with are zombies. Which, honestly, that really isn't that bad. Although, I put away my knife, so... Let's see if I come to regret that decision. I'm already coming to regret it. It missed! Huh. Yeah, but I got healing items, so I'm okay. It's probably somewhere in here. I feel like they just keep missing. That was close. Wow, look at that. They're all dead? Good. A uh, side pack was in this room somewhere, I think. Oh, okay, there we go. Yeah, I knew it was early on. Alright, and I think this is actually as far as I got last time. I guess I'll quickly enter this room. After that, I think I'm just going to take the elevator and go into the basement to try and get that handgun upgrade. I can't go down here, right? Oh yeah, I can, but there's really no point. That's right. 
And that door should still be bolted shut. Uh, the doorknob's missing. That was it. Alright. Yeah, that'll do for now. I caught up. I need a little catch-up episode to go over what's happened. Had to replay through the game so many times already. Ugh. I'm not gonna forget this when I get to final review. But that's it for now. We'll enter the basement, I believe, in the next video. Until then, this has been TalesFan109, and have a nice day.